you're gonna have RBC gas. So why does this happen? Why do you get an upper respiratory tract infection and then you develop glomerular nephritis? What is the reason? Is your body supposed to always keep producing IgA? No, right? You need to have, what is, whenever you look at a B cell, if you take any B cell, right? What is the first two antibodies it's gonna produce? M and D, okay? M and D. M and D are your first two antibodies that are typically produced. You don't have IgA. In order for you to produce IgA, you need to undergo something known as isotype class switching. Meaning, this B cell needs to eat up the antigen, go present to a T helper cell, and then the T helper cell is going to release certain interleukins. The way you're going to remember is Ig interleukin 5 for A, interleukin 4 for E. Forever 5 always. Forever 5 always, right? 